Welcome to AMB 2024. We're lucky enough to be here with Lutter on the Blom stand. Wow. And you're showing us actually some piece of technology that people might know quite well. This is quite a well-known Blum uh, piece of hardware. But why are you showing us it now in 2024? Yeah, everybody know the LC50 Digilog. That's the not newest generation, but it's a standard on a machine tool. So everybody who needs to control the tools for breakage, for length measurement, for radius measurement, is aware of that technology. The Digilog technology make, offers much more solutions, not only to do those base functions, but as well to check the wear, the situation of the tool, vibration, and last but not least, a lot of data that are available with the technology makes it possible for us to, uh, to increase the reliability in the machine tool, which is very uh, important for any modern machining, and Absolutely. to realize better uh, usage for the operator. And why is there a bigger need for this technology to actually be able to do a lot more than just soldameter length and tool breakage? As you can see here, with the cobot, an automation of, uh, of the machine. The pressure of the, for the production is today to speed up their production uh, volume, to handle multiple different work pieces, and of course the, the lot numbers are increasing, yeah, not day by day, but changing very fast. And for this, they need uh, an equipment that makes it possible to control the process to keep it stable and therefore measuring devices are used on the machine not only for uh, tool measurement but as well for the workpiece yeah they don't just make the operator's life easier trying to probe up the workpiece they make the robot's life easier too yes so Luta, as well as tool breakage detection which has been used for a long time with these uh, with these scanners what else um, can the LC50 do that helps with process security and control with an automated machine? To control, for example, the wear of the tool, uh, that could be done. That's also another base function. Uh, whether it's uh, uh, an end mill or a, a ball end nose. And we can see this on the actual on the control. Here, for sure. You've got a readout here that shows the actual the data coming off the laser scanner. We've been seeing stuff like, uh, we've seen ball nose measurement. Uh, and what other things can we see with LC Vision? In this case, it's an end mill where we see uh, every single cutting edge could be measured and detected for breakage just to evaluate if the tool is good in, in, in a good shape. And that is uh, the visualization uh, that is done by LC Vision. Right, so if you've got a chip on one, like a, maybe you could have a PCD cutter with a, with a I don't know, 25 or just, flutes. Or just one cutting edge is broken that will defect maybe not only the, the dimension, but the quality of the surface that could be one uh, requirement that is necessary. Nobody knows, the operator knows what is necessary. We need to act and use the equipment and the visualization to make it easy to realize what, what action should be done. Absolutely. That should be implemented in the ANSI program uh, to realize a, a controlled process to make it more stable. Yeah, there's so many variables with a cutting tool that can change the way it performs, and you can measure a lot of those with this scanner and with the readout with LC Vision. Um, once you've got a machine like this that's packed full of Blum technology, so the process is controlled really well, um, what happens when you have a factory full of these? How do you manage um, that process security across machine tools? Well, Rowan, for this, we have Form Control X. What I can show you here on the screen in Form Control X is a measuring uh, software that combine all these uh, needs to handle multiple uh, machines, different kind of machine, three axis, five axis machine, automated machines for sure, different work pieces, and put that all together, store the data, and then connect the machines to the correct data and visualize uh, the measuring results on the display. And so you've got like a CAD CAM system that can help with programming the probing programs as well, and send those to the machine control. Um, and then also machines then feed back those measurement information. You can exactly. see it all on one on one screen, on a tablet or a computer, on your, on in a your PC, machine on office. On a tablet, wherever it is needed. Uh, we can show it here on the on the boot. The machine here is connected. That is that is standard and it's, it will be set up by our engineers in the beginning. And then uh, the operator can check it from, yeah. From wherever. From, from wherever. Brilliant. On the weekend, yeah. you can realize a 24-7 production and to control and have a look on, uh, on how stable it is 
and uh, make your evaluation. Yeah. Brilliant. So if you're worried about process security, even if your machines are running at the weekend, make sure you check out Blum uh, equipment, test equipment, and also Blum software for total process security across your factory.